Alrighty. Let's see if I can get the cursor going. What? Ready. <clears throat> Very first thing I need to do. Uh, trying to hit I to open my inventory. I need to go take off these earplugs. Try and remember what everyone had. Okay, you have a cat's paw. You have a clove. No. You have a power token. Okay. What are these? Oh, he can he use buzz saws? Is that what that symbol is? I did not realize. I would have bought a bus. Oh, I guess I can. So let's go get him a bus saw. Which money do I have? A oh, plenty. <laughs> I'll keep this line up. Uh, and I have to figure out who the heck sells the buzz saws here. Might be the lady with the wrenches up here. You. Hello, take your time. Hello. He can steal. Yeah, let's get him a bus saw. What are we doing for breads? We're almost out of breads. So we will grab some more. I feel like we should have one more potion at least. Greens. Oh, we're almost at the point that core relics make sense. That aren't a complete waste. Let's get one more core rune, though. Still wiles off for roots really making sense. I wish there was like a, a 150 hit points or something. Alright, let's throw this bus on this bad boy. Oh, that's not a buzz saw? Hell crap. So it's the same symbol as the buzz saws, but he can't equip a buzz saw. Okay. Sure. Well, Grub will be happy that we got him a buzz saw, I guess. We need to go all the way back to Shell 7 and finish exploring it. We still don't know how to talk to the weird backwards aliens. So hopefully we find something there in either the lake or forest that will help us. Read the book passage off shell? Betcha. Where do you want to go then? Hey Alex, are the NPCs voices um audible enough? Is it loud enough? Let me make him talk again. Read the book passage off shell.
good. I want to be slightly louder. Where you want to go then? So how do these folks gather? Oh yeah, there's something... That's definitely backwards speak. There's something that we have to put inside these totem poles, I'm guessing? There's hollow areas in the bone, like a tubing. I wonder what goes in there. Figure that out. some beetles. If there's any point trying to steal from non-humanoids. that you found on a random bug. Wake or forest first. Let's save. Take a look at the link. We'll see if this crashes the game. I guess we have to fight this Helgak first, but... I think that we crashed the game like three or four times last time by trying to throw bombs in here. It's too deep to cross and it looks poisonous. During the resource war, these pools killed many a man trying to cross them. Very poisonous. We used to dynamite the lakes and walk over the dead Helgak that would float to the surface. Helgak, we must slay you. Forgot about that weird spore thing. That was the first time we fought a Helgak and did not get berserked. Feel stronger than before. Okay, and we can walk across this without crashing. It's looking good. We 
Do we still have our bomb? No, we do not. Let's save. Because we did have a lot of crashes at the lake. We've successfully done it. Did we fight that sleepy dude? I feel like we probably should. Hello. Wakey wakey. Oh, there are two of them. Now is that a two of them? You go for this one. Yes, big damage. No animals sleep on my watch. I mean, look at this. Oh, God, this map. I forgot this was disgusting. Wait, did we go down this, like, long tail over near the start? Yeah, there's like... Oh, okay. A bird! There, I have freed a bird. I guess we're up to four birds. Freed from starvation. Um, if I leave this area and come back, are these dead Helgak bodies still going to be floating around? I hope so. Ugh. Okay, fight four plants. I think that uh, Aram can take out these two all by himself. One here. Uh, no, I was kidding. I don't want to miss anything, so let's go make sure we've walked everywhere. You know, you're supposed to leave no trace when you go out into like the the wilderness. That's not uh not how we do it. We want to leave a trace of our presence everywhere. This is like a darker green. What? He crushed it.
Oh, there was nothing else this way. That was a fun waste of time. I guess we're going up the bones. The bone broth. Oh, got graveyard. This is not a large area. This looks like a little piece of Helgat bone. I wish I could look at all of these larger pieces of bones and have it be like, that looks like a big piece of Helgak bone. What is this thing? Those are just like the leaves of a plant? Helgak bones. I wonder if this would float. Looks almost like a boat. Oh. Bigger they are, bigger the corpse. Thanks. Okay, I don't know why a Helgak bone would float. Helgak float, but that's because they generate hot air. some way for me to get inside of this. I've ground up the Helgak flute with the mortar and pestle. Ground up the Helgak flute? Is that what she called it? Luckily I did not use it up. Uh, maybe there isn't a way for us to get on this just yet. Please. Called it a flute, I think. So maybe I need to jam it into those big bones at the alien village and like blow into it. Try and get out of here with the minimal amount of fighting. Well, so much for that. Probably have to fight the Hellgack down here as well. Oh, maybe not. I 
assuming the other thing I need to put in that mortar and pestle is in this forest. So let's just go investigate in here before we go back to the weird alien village. Oh, can I go down here? No. Let's just go all the way to the, the hmm. Let's say let's just go all the way to the left. What's a real pain in the ass to get to that top left corner? I wonder if there's something tasty up there. How do these two halves connect? look like they do unless this bottom right entrance leads to the top right one that might be the case let's just go left then I mean right this whoa damn it I should save after this battle as well. I can't believe this guy gave me like a jump scare. Let's save. Save game. Mold Forest. We'll save over Mold Forest. anything. Uh-oh. What are these? Oh. Okay. What are they? Get the top. Let's try again. Ooh, they do not fall in one hit. That's no good. They're very hard to hit. Well, since we might have to actually eat some bread. Oh. 
Hopefully we can kill this guy. Maybe? Okay, don't miss my... It's a decent amount of XP at least. here. There's some sort of gross, goopy creature. It's all mold. Big damage. Um, okay, you do that. Maya, you'll have to use a potion, I think. I oh, know, Maya can just clean, clean up this. Jeez, that did a lot of damage. Okay. Yeah, we'll eat a potion. There, is there ever anything good in these out-of-the-way areas? Not really. It's just the XP. That's a reward. Killing is its own reward. <laughs> yes, Alex. Indeed. The real murder was the friends we made along the way. Oh god, another blue one. Found something interesting looking. So we have a blue spore mushroom, a red one, and it looks like one of those horrible bugs. Let's save again. Well, let's do this. I think we focus on that blue one because it can do massive damage. Oh, I didn't hit both of them? So what BS is that? Come on. Oh. 
I got a little sport. Getting a decent amount of XP here, so that's something good. What is this? It looks like ruins of some sort. I don't see a place for a key. We'll never get through there. Oh, way to be optimistic, Corrigan. I've seen the Underlost open these old doors. We'll never get through there. So, okay. Let's see what was around if we go at, it, at that from the other side. Is there just another force field? Pain, I'm gonna walk all the way back this way, but at the very least, we'd kill everything in our way. Leave only bodies in our wake. Somewhere around here. Okay, there's another spore to fight. Oh, it's up there. Oh, okay, that's just how we get to the other side. I didn't notice this little pathway down here. I don't think that we actually need to bother fighting just right now. I'm sure we will fight them in the future. Do we go up or down here? That's the question. Let's save again. Mold. Mold. Go down. <coughs> uh, the air is unbreathable. Great. I don't think I have anything that's like an earplug, but for air. Okay, we'll have to get masks or something. Of course, that has to be the case. Oh, 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 friends. So cute.
could do like one damage. What's the point of even having them be a combat? I guess they. At least that one did heal itself, drinking, drinking my blood. Let's see if we can do some, just a one, one action attack. No, not quite. Two comes in just a moment. Why do we have so much XP for him, though? I don't understand. Gotta be something at the end of this little round. Oh no, what is that different colored Helgak? Or is that just the light? Ah, oh, it's a gross poison Helgak. It's not berserking me. These stupid spider wasp things. Just two, though. Let's see if two level sort of two attacks. No reason to wait till it's fully charged. Okay, Corgan should kill it. be a big fight up here. Well, okay, that's just a wasp nest. Here, there has to be something interesting. A red mushroom? These kind of plants look like they can open up. I have no knowledge of such things. Of course not. You know how hard these plants make night warfare? Light up the whole place like a spotlight. Okay, so this is when they put that lantern, right? Open them up first. Just, just give it a tickle.
So I probably don't have what I need to open it. Try the bird seed. No. Do we open it? Oh, hello, Helgax. I guess I have the small bone piece. I will see if there's something I can do with that. Oh no, I'm berserk. Kill these foul beasts. Eat our breads. It's dinner time, boys. We've all gotten our fill of bread now. Time to make our way back out. Look like This one down here. Oh my, why you got a mess? Closer read a level. Okay, Corgan and Aram are super close. Like just a another two combats like that, maybe. Oh, well, not not hang this. This won't give us a whole lot. Thinking one or two more combats. 
Or is that thing not? I don't know why we aren't being attacked by these, but I don't mind. Later. Let's go visit our alien friends. Actually, yeah, alien friends. Uh, so maybe we can talk to this guy about plants. Maybe he'll tell me how they open. Uh, hello there. Is there a way through the ruins in the mold forest? The old underlost ruins. They can only be passed by the blue freaks of the Bone Circle Village. They made them in the first place. Why do the mold forest plants glow? They have nectar that glows. Most only have a little, but some have a lot. Uh, tracks the Helgak. They only open up when the Helgak sing their mating calls. Uh, the animals drink the nectar and spread the plant spores around the forest. Only certain materials can pick up the nectar without killing the glow, though, like a uh, bioloom lantern. What's with the bone circles around the village to the east? The Underlost believe it will protect them. they made of Helgak bone, which is an awesome conductor for sound. They carve areas into the bones that might light up when you put on the bioluminescent mold plant nectar in them. That glowing stuff is the only thing them freaks can see. Guess that was actually not very helpful at all. How do I get this nectar again? Why do the mold forest plants glow? They have nectar that glows. Most only have a little, but some have a lot. Uh, tracks the Helgak. They only open up when the Helgak sing their mating calls. Uh, the animals drink the nectar and spread the plant spores around the forest. Only certain materials can pick up the nectar without killing the glow, though, like a uh, bioloom lantern. Do we need to make a Helgak mating call next to that plant? How does that work? Is that what I do with this bone? I put some of the bone in this mix bowl. She called it a flute. But it still just says Helgak bone. Uh, should it not be a bone? Oh, you're right, you're right. Yeah, we'll, we'll... Man, all the walking around that they make you do in this. I do not have a flute yet. Just a bone that I've called a flute. Well, I guess I need to look for something that sells masks or something. There a crab there. there wasn't a crab there before. Seriously, a lot of walking back and forth. Hey, buddy. There's 
my cursor. Where to? I need like a surfboard or something to get across that lake. Let's see, there's a whole bunch of thundercats I need to fight in the forest over here. Let me just go, I want to look up here and see if there's an extra bird at this tower now. This is where all the birds I feed go. Yeah, okay. So when I feed a bird, it comes here. That's the bird paradise tower. The carving dude, he's, uh, he's in this one. What can I do for you? What do you sell here? I carve art from the bones of the Helgak. Hmm. Do you know anything of the large tomb in the graveyard? Most believe it to lead to the catacombs I'm trying to use the city, it on him, maybe. and therefore a pathway to the dead. If you ask me, as long as it is closed, the tomb keeps the dead underground, which is fine by me. Yes. Can you carve this? Easily. <laughs> Helgak bone like this is great musical instruments. It is said that only the bone of Helgak can reproduce the sounds of the Helgak's mating call. When you play it, How it lucky. will mimic the sounds of a Helgak. Mating Helgak. Just any Helgak. Welcome. Look around. What else? I put a bone in it. I don't know. Am I not supposed to? Won't be an armor seal, I guess, that protects me from spores, would it? I need a mask, I'm assuming. Go talk to Blacksmith to do here. Then we'll talk to everyone in the red light district. See if we can find someone selling a mask. Alright, what do you know about special colorful birds? Nothing. Can I interest you in anything? Oh, maybe. Maybe not. Get Corgan his honor blade. It's only two more core and it's minus 10 striking power. No thanks. What a rip. Okay, let's go back to the red light district. Bought the mix bowl from can tell us why we have a bone in it. Oh, 
Where to? What's that? Number four. This way, please. Can I interest you in anything? Will it be? Will it be? from the weirdo aliens after we light up their bone circle. Hello, take your time. I can use my cursor. Underlost boots. Oh, okay, these claw and, claw and skin things are for underlost. Yes. I guess that means we'll get a weirdo, stupid, blind alien thing as a party member. Hello. What do you sell? Healing herbs and medicine. You could buy another mix bowl. Get another mix bowl. Potion, another bread. <laughs> I can put this Helgak flute into the other mix bowl now. Let's save. Save here. Oh, see, see if it does. I've ground up the Helgak flute with the mortar and pestle. I have two mixed bowls with bone. Let's live. I want to keep one uh, bowl without the bone in it. Hello, take your time. I mean, no one has anything that sounds like it would protect me from, like, weird air. Do we need to sleep again? Yeah, might as well. Well, we'll take a nap while we're here.
do you have a room for the night? That, that doesn't destroy. Let's go back, let's open up that plant. Make it think for a lusty Helgak. Read a book passage off shell? Where you want to go then? <sighs> we have to go all the way back to the mold forest and to the end of the mold forest to open up the dang flower. We can scoop up some bioluminescent nectar or spores or something. With the crab left. level 16 now and Corgan is so dang close to level 18 leave that guy asleep. The spider wasp is over here though with her uh, weird looking bodies. These should bring Corgan up to the next level.
drop some tasty spider bread. birds. There's a sound effect for the Helgak mating call. I want to hear it. And more spider things. blow this uh, loot and then it's going to like summon a, a, a horny mega helgak or something for me to fight. Diddle. I'll go drip this all over their weird pillar things. I don't know how exactly that's going to help us. Like, they'll be able to see that we have done that, I guess. And somehow that'll be useful. Even if they can't visually see us, they can hear things, 
It's like, they could surely hear that we're there. I don't know. It seems strange. This path. Go all back through this cave. to let us somehow communicate. Take out the left bug first, I guess. Take out this bug all by yourself. Come on. Nope, not quite. Whoa. Needs like a battle fanfare, like, like Final Fantasy. Whoa. No! I don't want to fight the crab. Double crab. Can I just run? I'm going to try. This is just so annoying to fight. Oh, oh. Yeah. Scared of crabs. They've just harmless crustaceans. Put this pillars? Oh, there's a green one. They have a bit like Protoss dreadlocks. I think we proved to them we want to help. We're probably the only outlanders to ever try and communicate on their level. Maybe they'll let us pass now. Oh, okay. That was easy. And of course, they have just like a regular looking Greetings, table chairs. Outlander. You speak our tongue? Where are your villagers? Taken. Outlanders take a slave. Okay. Tell me about the Chosen. The Chosen took your people, didn't they? Outlanders took many. You enemy. Of them? Yes. Jeez. But we don't know how to find them. Our greatest warrior, help. Take you to them and bring back Underlost. Badu help you get to Outlander. Help you kill Outlander. Thank you. So I found uses knives. Dude, he has a lot of health. Not a lot of core, but that's fine. You're better than Aaron. Other equipment to use. Claw ties, power knives, skins. Here, you need earplugs.
Yeah, we'll have to get this weird dude some cool armor somewhere. Your town has very few structures. We leave old village behind many years ago. Stay here when Hell God attack old village. Claw of God Hell still God. in old village. Where's that? In mold forest. You no go. Deep forest is poison to outlanders. Helmets. Uh, Need helmets. You mean gas masks? Yeah, where do I get a gas mask? How does one pass the ruins in the mold forest? Cannot open unless under lost help. Sounds like it's doing like a bad Yoda impression or something. Oh, am I sleeping? Resting up? Well, that's convenient. So I have to go all the way back to the red light district. I have never thought I was no die. Okay. I want some ground up bones. How you do? What abilities do you have? Knife, knife hit, knife strike, core knife. This is 10 core energy. Okay, help me fight these beetles. Oh no, giant enemy crab is still there. Okay, he's only a little bit slower than us. I guess he's more like a runner. He's real slow, but does a lot of damage and has a lot of health. Go buy Badu some like real equipment. I'm sure I can afford better equipment for him. Oh, well. What is it? What is it, boy? He must have been able to sense the ore in the wall. Ore? Sure. This stuff looks valuable, but I'd have to dig it out if I wanted any. Ore like this is used to make many treasures in Wind City. Hey, there was ore. He seems to recognize the ore. I'll bet his people have been working with it for hundreds of years. Cool, cool story. Well, I don't have anything to get out with, so... I was just gonna have to stay there, my man.
Let's see. Yeah, we'll just follow this top sort of wall. Does he just touch the thing and it opens? Well, that was pretty okay. slick. I wonder what else that radar power could be good for. Radar power? Maybe I'll find helmets and or gas masks over here. Whoa, what is that? There's another sleepy boy and... Oh, it's it's an upgrade of those garbage monsters. It just looks like a, a trash bug. Take him out. Oh, we did not do a lot of damage. He's really upgraded. Okay, okay. I'll try his core and then remove that. This little thing is tough. And it life siphons. Core knife. I guess I could let this fully charge. So, I didn't really fight many of those. Kind of really annoying. Just a fight. Oh, a trash can. C prism. It's a C prism. That's from water based damage. You have a C prism, Badu. We'll just hug the uh, northern wall. Let's get down here. Ah. Okay, what do we kill first? This spider. I'm really liking Madu. No, 
I was hoping there'd be another trash can down here. Let's just follow the northern path. Actually, wasn't all that bad to navigate through, even though the map looks like horrible. Is there a chest or something over here? No, I don't want to fight another garbage manta ray. Who's? Yeah. Okay, they don't seem all that tough, so. They do move very quickly. here. Let's just murder all of the Chosen that are here. Oh, where are you? That's not a regular soldier, dude. Okay, we'll kill that guy first. of a run-down looking mining operation. Whoa. Okay, so there's an exit over there, but what's down below? Let's explore down. Or is there just literally nothing down here? Nope. Oh, that's cool. Badu, it's on you. Big damage. Hmm. 
there actually anything over here though? There seems to be a resounding no. Like, yes, we are going for that exit on our left. Sure, let's go down, then back up the other way. That was neat, though. I liked how they all rode in here on, like, minecarts. Oh, I want to explore more. A few more fights. Oh, okay. Let them fully charge. Is those some still a lot of damage? Yeah, what's over here? Yeah, there's a dude. Guys, we can do that. Ow! Okay, I need to heal her. Okay, my eat my eat a bread, eat a bread. Yeah, no, cast um Oh, you know what? We can try summoning Thanatos on it. Let's see, we can summon Ouroboros. Summon Sedna and Pill Attack. Summon Smurg. Summon Wumbaba. Summon Thanatos. Summon Tira. Is that just like a heal party summon, maybe? <laughs> I mean, it sounds stupid to summon this for this this dude, but I just want to see what it, what it looks like. We're doing it. Summoning Thanatos for this one random move. That was neat. It wasn't worth that much core energy. But it looked pretty cool. Yeah, let's... Is this an even better symbol?
Who knows? I guess that's not something we can cast outside of combat. Reds. Let's just go leave the zone. Further south. Hello, the rescue you. Hopeful you are. go down this pathway here. Okay, we have a stairway up. Nothing else interesting down here. Big room path there. This now adds to strength. You can use metal buckle. Uh, but we'll keep on having a pretty sea prison. Whoa! Okay, um. I wasn't expecting, like, max. Systems have a lot of armor. Uh, take it down, please. Awesome. You better give me a decent amount of XP. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's not bad. And we got a root, so... It's sort of worth it. Let's see, there's a way up. There's another way down. You take out the clawman. Corrigan, what is up with you? Okay, I'm real disappointed, guys. go near the walls in case robots jump out. Well, let's save. Close. Let's save over here. Okay, that's... Is that the same type of giant robot, or is that a tough one? Okay, so we can't do anything on this edge. We'll kill you, Mr. Robot. What? Okay, I wasn't expecting that. This is just one robot, though. I'm gonna collapse the whole mine on. Throwing like a big temper tantrum. You killed us. some leveling up. Uh, so I think I do want to explore down here more. Go up to the next level. Let's go all the way down this big hallway. Let's get something has to be down here, right? Be like a big empty space full of combats now, would it? Oh, 
Okay, nice. We've got the moves. And no trash can there. Please, there has to be something up here. Tell me I didn't walk all this way for nothing. I did, didn't I? Hmm. Alright. Mildly annoying. Why even put weird dead ends if you're not going to have stuff in them? That's my biggest complaint so far. Especially since, like, there is a map function. Alexa, please stop. Alexa, please stop. So it's like, if I go down one of those dancers, it's because I have- Hey Delta! How is it going? How's your week been going? Good, good, good. wandering around aimlessly right now in this. Still fighting the controls a little bit. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Busy, but good. Where am I going? I need to go up that stairway to the right. Something interesting? So much like just dead space on these maps. Okay, next area. Well, well, it's about time. Uh, I should say. Welcome to the glorious Crap. mining operation of Lord Doskis. I am Caleb, at your service. Gunner's fleet is on his way. Surrender. Gunner. What is that weird so he bug? he sent you to do his dirty work while he runs home to ask for more toys, eh? Short-sighted fool. Well, too late, girl. Doskius' lenses girl. are already completed. He only awaits the right time to unleash them on the core. Well, then you're of no use to us. <laughs> we have to reach those lens platforms. Surrender or die. No. I think you can deal with my mining Helgak. It the should Helgak? to destroy you. Sure. It doesn't look like any of the other Hel Helgak. This big boy. Does a lot of damage, but I think it will be okay. Maybe. Might need to drop a potion. Zero damage, awesome. Um, I'll have my uh, eat a potion when it's uh, her turn next. Right. Okay, 
Vale. I'm a bit confused because I don't see like damage pop blocks um, for some of these attacks. Yeah, we need a potion. Actually, learn from a previous boss fight that Observe does not generally work on these, but we'll try it. Can you give me a health bar? No. Just a waste of turn. Hopefully this isn't like a puzzle encounter that we have to figure out. I get so many actions before I can act. And the only thing it can target is its weirdo math, so. And this is what we have to do, just keep slapping it in the face. Should have got um Badu some better equipment. I should have read the thing, I guess. What element is Earth weak to in this? I should probably use a spell or something. like a lot of feedback on how I'm doing in this. Really needs to have like a boss health bar or something. Like, like there was no damage pop off there. I don't know how much damage I did. I don't know if this is effective. I don't know if there's like the crab, I should just be doing like my level 1 weakest attacks each time. Uh, I'll try a spell. Uh, water maybe? Hydro. Again, without damage pop-offs, I don't know if that's more effective than my melee attack, or less effective. If I used a different spell, I can't compare and see, like, which one's weak against. Kind of really unsatisfying. Oh, his head is out. Is this just a waiting game for waiting for his head to open? Should I just sit here and do nothing until his head opens? And then all three of us attack. Does that even work? Or does he just close the moment that 
Um, I don't know. What happens if I just wait? This is the stupidest thing. I feel like this can't be what I'm supposed to do. I'll save Badu's fully charged attack for whenever he opens his face. Maybe he opens his face after a certain number of uh, Maya and Corgan's attacks. I have to heal Corgan soon. Something I'm supposed to be paying attention to for like knowing when it's going to open or what opens. It. Oh, Badu, it's your time to shine. at him with these guys while Badu charges. Maya might need to heal Corrigan. We'll let him take one more hit. through all of our potions here. Oh well. Charge. Charge, Badu! No. No! It's gonna kill Gordon. Heal self before you do anything else, Maya. Then we need to resurrect Corrigan. Badu. Heal a little bit. Back to plinking. Okay. Even if Badu isn't fully charged, we need to attack as soon as its head opens, I think. Otherwise, they'll do that big attack on everyone at once. Okay. 
Now, Fadu. Please die. How many times do I have to do this? Shove bread into Badu's mouth. You blink. I do, you just gotta go in there. Really? This is just such a long combat. How many times do I have to do that? Socks. Oh. Or you need to shove bread in the miles mouth now. I'm just Corgan's health was lower, so it wouldn't be as wasted. Oh, no, it's Badu time. Badu can. Just use another potion, I guess. <sighs> so frustrated. Imagine if I didn't stock up on so many, like, restorative items.
full fully charged Badu. Get in there. Whew! Thank goodness. Kind of like we did it. That's a lot of XP. Maya leveled. Corgan. Badu. Awesome. Everyone leveled. Poor thing. We have to follow Caleb to the lenses. If they have mining Helgax, what do they need to enslave Underlost for in the mine? Doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, we need to save. Oh, I need to order a dinner right quick. <laughs> is what Alex was trying to remind me about, but I was in the middle of a combat, so. I'm going to be right back. Let me. Whoa, oops.
Okay, sorry about that. I am back. Okay, so let's see. Did we save? Let's save. I've chosen the Lord save. We have a ton of gold. I can't wait to get back to the town. Oh no, not a big robo. And I guess we're probably gonna have like another boss fight with Caleb or whatever at the end of this section. And hopefully we can survive. Oh! How do I miss a giant map? Dude, it's up to you. Kill him. Yeah. Please. But do finish it. What was that sound? He made like a dying llama sound. Is that what chosen sounds like? giant robot in this room with you, sir. Wait. Let's save again. I want to save frequently here. So we opened up that room. Should we go straight there or go north? Woo. Okay, there's more levers. Big robo over there. What is Helgak boats? No, what am I fighting? Uh, where did you come from? We have to take um take that trick. Teamwork. Do the same here. Level two, Corgan, Maya, and just level one bot do that. Gotta kill as quick as possible. Nothing up here. Was this just a dead end of combat?
Okay, we need to heal up. We have four breads left. That will have to hide us over. Whoa! What are you doing here? Don't save me. Save. We save again. So, we opened this door over here. Might as well go take a look. Oh! A canister. A solid strike. What is this? Adds to strike. You know, I could probably use that. Sure. Cat's paw increases speed and power and stuff? Okay, let's use the cat's paw instead. That's much more useful. How about for you, though? So you're using... So if you use the solid strike... That metal buckle's pretty dang good. Yeah, use the metal buckle. And Shark Boy over here, he can use... No, get that C prism out of here, he can use solid strike. Solid snake. Can I interact with anything else in here? No. Big no. Okay, though that was pretty helpful. Now there's a giant robot over here. It sucks, but I don't see any way around him. Well. Is it just the one? Yeah, okay. I didn't know he had a multi-attack. Besides his uh, smash the ground attack. What's this? In the name of the Holy Chosen Emperor, I vanquish the heretic Doskius. Doskius! Oh, you bastard! Thank Selena. you, dear Selena. You have done your people a great service. He's getting away. Mm -hmm. I only meant to stop him, not let him get away. We have to get out of here. <sighs> Could have had a game over right there, yo. Know? Just let him kill God Doskius. Sorry if this is really loud. The cutscenes are just unimaginably Mine. loud compared Wake to the rest up. of the game. Where am I? Wake up, Maya. You have much to do. M Mom? It's me, Corgan. That poor right? What happened? The lens platforms must have crashed here. But where are we? Give me that. Let's bring that to that miner, It looks dude. like a shard in the core lens. Okay. Interesting map. What? Who are you guys? Oh, bounty hunters.
heck am I now? Is it still Shell 7? It looks completely... Oh, this must be Shell 6. The pirate one. Okay, so we have Scum Town. That sounds like a great place. And we have Mountain Pirate Base West. Let's go to Scum Town. It's my favorite place to be. Okay, shipping docks, the barter mall. Just those two locations. All right, barter mall. Guess they sell weapons in here. Sir. Sir, I'd like to browse your wares. Can I interest you in anything? <laughs> you can't just keep using that same voice. Especially for a character that looks like that. Oh, hell. Shrapnel. A small blitzer. Okay, I could use that. Let's pick one up. Pick up a shrapnel and a napalm. Shrapnel. Okay, so the grenade and shrapnel just look like shotgun shells on the side of my weapon. But the napalm actually gets like a cool little napalm canister. So that's neat. Put a small blitzer in there. Okay. Looks like that's only weapons and stuff for Maya, but how do you do? My name's Maya, and this is Maya. Somebody was looking for you. Oh, where are they now? Going to attack me? They went to look on the other side of the mountains. Oh. Are there any emissaries of the Seven Winds here? You mean Marduk's Pansy Squad? No, <laughs> sir. Hey, they always are. <laughs> Rogue's Pansy Squad. The pirates must be ecstatic. The Janam and Ankara are gone. Well, those two countries are the only thing holding them back. Who knows what they're gonna do now? Who knows? <sighs> What's that? Oh, swords. Hello. Hey, baby. Um, okay, or or don't trade with me. That's cool, too. Just be like standing in a very specific spot to trade. Welcome. Look around. I will. Okay, we have bone knives. That's a big improvement. Wait. Long sword is better than bastard sword? Now, I guess it would be. Like I, I guess, I guess long swords are two-handed swords. IRL. But coming from like D and D, this seems very backwards. Whatever. Yep. Long sword. Oh, and we got you some sort of a knife thing. Oh, he has a poison spit attack now. When did he get that? Poison spit. 
Okay, that's just a thing he can do now. Well, that's cool. Need armor. We find an armor. Tattoo parlor. Did you see the battle in the skies? Who didn't? You know, big hunks of core I just fell from the sky? That'll keep Connor rolling in the dough for a while. Who's Connor? Who is this Connor I hear about? Connor? Don't go messing with him, girl. He's bad news. Yeah, girl. Is there any government here? Only the pirate gangs. The biggest is Connor's. What's all the commotion? We found big slabs of core material fell from the sky. We thought we wouldn't get any more after the Shell 5 war, and now the mother load comes falling on our head. Hey, there was a... I go in the tattoo parlor, yes. Hello. Hello there. Would you care to buy anything? I'd like to buy an armored tattoo. No. You just sell... equipment. Uh, you do sell a better ranch, though. Okay, so buzz saws only grub can use, but blades, both grub and air arum, can use. Meat? Wait, what is meat for? Everybody can use it? Fine, I'm going to take that one meat to see what that does. Maybe I can put it with the bone in the mixing bowl. Make some, some bone broth. Give me, give me a meat. What can I possibly do with meat? Right, the answer is nothing. What can I do with core material? Nothing. Well, that's fine. Hello, do you sell armor? What can I do for you? What kind of place is this? That two parlor, tattoo can't parlor. you read? Want one? It was there for a second. There we go. What kind of tattoos do you do? I do most of the working girls that come through here. They like full body jobs, like Kira. Tattoos go back to the story of Kira. She was a goddess of light and love, and her natural flesh was a pattern of magical symbols. We get a lot of call for that. Working girls from the bazaar and slave girls. Yeah. What can you tell about Connor? Tell me about this Connor. Oh, he's a funny one. Obsessed with Kira the Love Goddess. He has all of his women made up like her. Some say he's searching for the legendary Kira's mirror, the one she used to make the stars. I'm just looking for an armor place. I hope it's this last door over here. Yeah, that says armor, I think. Oh. You sure are orange. Will it be? Oh, okay, maybe not in your close up portrait. Please. Right now it's speed sixty three. It doesn't sell anything with better armor. But you, you can use animal skins. I guess we can get you some freaking animal skins. Oh, though they make them even slower. Wing shoes.
Okay, give me two wing shoes. Their description. They're just boots. Okay. What about you? Quad pads. Sure. Go ahead and equip all of this. Wing shoots. Yeah, that's it for you. Wing shoes. You get claw pads and animal skins. Aw, oh, his appearance doesn't seem to change. That's fine. Oh, actually, that's all of our old junk. Will it be? We will sell the skins. I don't think anyone else will get value out of that. Um, I think that we have this leather vest for grub. Yeah. We'll want to just buy a better armor if we ever get grub in our party again. Might as well save it. It doesn't even... Yeah, I'll, I'll just hold on to it. We'll sell the skins, though. We'll sell the claw tides. We'll sell the fast shoes. Keep the power engine for grub. Sell the bastard swords, sell the power knives. Okay, we made back a decent amount of money. Let me check something right quick. Leave. I guess we have to go through the mountain base and see who's trying to find us. Maybe, maybe Selena. Hopefully she apologizes for being such a colossal scrub. Oh, what is this? Greenmire Swamp. Southmire. East Marsh. West Swamp. Okay, Southmire. Oh, no, there's, there's things there. We'll come back to the swamps. I think it was trying to give us a hint, hint that we should go through here. Oh, lovely. Who doesn't want a pirate base with skeletons hung up everywhere? Let's save. What do you want? Out of my way. No, Too don't be bad. so rude, no one passes without paying the toll. And just what is that? Come Your here, life. I'll show you. Wow. Even worse. Um. Well, we fight. Let's go. Uh -oh. The troll toll. It's the one that sucks because it puts up barriers.
playing DVD? Just avoid that, dude. Okay. I guess we have to get up there. No, oh, no, maybe we don't. What's what's over here? I mean, I'm sure there's stuff up there that we'll want, but for now, let's just go through here. this other path. There's something here? No? Is this just a dead end? I can't believe that. This must be something that we interact with later then. Take a look here. Really? Must be a docking bay underwater. They must be pirates. No army with honor would cower beneath the waves like this. be here shortly. I might I might just get off and leave it there. I think we need to go in here and explore more of this pirate base. And we definitely need to go back to the scum town and uh, I didn't even look at the docking bay because um, I'm an idiot. So we'll do those two things next next time. Exploring Shell 6 is next time. It's uh yeah we'll just save a Skeletor. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get off. I'm gonna head out. Maybe uh, eat some, hang out with some homies. Later.